Hello everyone and welcome back to another Universe Sandbox 2 view. and today we're going to do another episode of checking out some of your guys' solar systems. So today we've got two from um, Nika or Blizmo um, Games, however you want to call him. So yeah, we'll just get straight into it guys. So okay, so the first system is called um, the Cryo system. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, search that up. So here we go. Right, so um, while we're loading in there guys, just a massive thank you um as always, for um, all the people who come back to every video and all that good stuff, just a massive, massive thank you, um, thank you to all for that. Cause it's absolutely amazing just how many people um, just come back every video now. It's, it's really, really cool. And just, yeah, I can't thank you guys all enough for that. And also, massive thanks to everyone who's recently subscribed as well. But anyways, here we go. So the cryo system is a binary system 8.5 light years away from the sun. It is the most well-known system also discovered. It has two stars, two planets, with the main star being cryo A. Planets were discovered like other exoplanets, but these were the moons. Okay, so here we are. So first, oh, it's actually a binary. Okay, so A and B, so we've got two of them there. Ratio, and then there are their stats. So uh, not, not the brightest star. And then the second one is 200 tons. So if we look at the zones, you can see there's uh, quite a difference there. Anyways, first planet. So it seems there's only two in here. So um, yeah, I've got f actually three systems of his to do stuff. So because I think two of them are quite small. So um, yeah, there's that. All right, so here's Cryo's B. So a very, very red object with a green trail. And then we have um, the smaller moon here, right there. Okay, so there is that one. And then moving out to the second planet. We've got a rainbow gas giant. I've seen one of the uh, rainbow gas giant in a while. It's tilted on its side like Uranus's. Is. So it is there. So there we go. Right, and then there are its moons. So we've got that one there. Second moon. And then the third moon down here. That one looks quite cool, actually. Huh, interesting. Right, so yeah, there is that one. Okay, so that is pretty much the whole system done. That's probably one of the quickest systems we've done ever, maybe. I'm not sure. So yeah, we'll just go ahead and move on to the uh, second system now. So the second one is called the... Ver where, yeah, this one here. So let's go ahead and load that one up. So this one is also um, quite small, I believe, as well. So um, here we go. Okay, so welcome to this system containing three lonely stars in one system. So let's get to it. Okay, so ABC is a system in its own. is actually trying to rediscover an Andromeda galaxy. Ah, oh, it was the first system to be found in another galaxy. Okay. Oh, so this is all, like, legit, then. It's not like a uh, fa or like a um, fantasy system. This is actually a real thing. Okay. So, um, a BOV supergiant known for being the biggest in the system. Okay, so that's this one. All right, um, there we go. Okay, so you can, I was actually told this. You can actually open the menu if you right-click it. Because usually I just I just click it and I left-click it like that. But if you right-click it, it actually opens the menu. So we can actually check the stats with the, with the, um, the text box open. So there is its stats. So that is uh, very bright, as we can see there. Pretty cool. Right, um, so it's the only blue star. Okay, so the Veros B, a red, su or a red super giant. This one also has plan or no planets since most super giants don't have any. Yeah, they would have eaten them all up by now. 7,000 luminosity of sun there. Right, and then C is the smallest um, in the system. It is a white um, giant, and the only white giant in the system. There's no planets around this star. So pretty a uh, lonely uh, trinary system here. But yeah, there we go. So that's quite a cool thing, um, how he's uh, made it of the Andromeda, an, an Andromeda solar system, which is quite cool. So yeah, there we go. So there are his two, like, micro systems. And then we'll go on to the... I'm assuming this will be the main show of the day. So it's called Nicker's Galaxy Binary. So let's see what he's uh, prepared for us in here. So, oh, it actually has galaxies in it. Okay, so this is the only binary um, two galaxies existing, and these two are unique. Okay, Galaxy A, similar to the Milky Way, this one has 500 billion stars. Galaxy B, slightly smaller galaxy, it has 50,000, okay, so way less than. Um, these two galaxies are have their own passing age. Okay, age of Galaxy A, 12.6 billion years, old in age, and then the other one is 7.8. Okay, making it younger than the galaxies known. Okay, so is there planets in here, or is it just galaxies? Okay, so there's 3,000 objects, so there's got to be... Huh, there's 3,000... I think it's just the amount of stars. Okay, I thought... So it's just these three small simulations, and there's not any, like, crazy big solar systems for today. So, um, yeah, there we are. So we have... Um, and actually, this is the first ever time that someone has sent in galaxies, um, actually, um, for one of these episodes. So, um, yeah, here we are. But obviously, you're, you're pretty much seeing the whole story right now. There's not really anything to zoom into here. It's just the... Uh, just two galaxies and then the black holes inside them. So, I mean... Yeah, there you go. So, um, yeah, there we are. I like how we um, put some little reading as well, because I do like a bit of reading in these systems. So, yeah, there we go. That is pretty much everything in here. I don't, I'm not finding any planets or anything. I think that is everything for these three systems today, guys. So, yeah, quite a short one, actually. I was, I was thinking there'd be more. 
um, with free um, systems to do because sometimes some people make absolutely enormous stuff. But it seems uh, this time around we only have some, we have three very small systems. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode nonetheless. And yeah, we are getting close to that big 100 now. And I heard that there's a collab. Um, if it's something very special that's going to be going on for episode 100, so that should be quite a big episode. So stay tuned for that, as hopefully we'll be on it by two weeks' time, maybe less than that, just depending on how many episodes I do. Episodes I, do. I mean, if you want, I, I could uh, maybe do more episodes a week if you want me to push closer to the 100 or not. But I don't know how, when the, or the collab system will be ready, so... Um, you guys let me know, should I uh, speed up doing these episodes or should I just keep them normal? Let me know down below in the comments, but yeah, that is everything, guys. So make sure um, you guys all have a great day. Let's see if we can go for 30 likes on today's video, guys. Also, subscribe if you're new. Helps on the journey to 10,000 subscribers. And also, if you want to send in your own systems, make sure to join my Discord link in the description. Go to the upload chat there. Then all you need to do is drag the um, drag the system file out of your universe sandbox folder into Discord. Then it will upload the um, a copy of your system. As simple as that. Or you can just message me in private messages, whichever one suits you the best. Um, yeah, that is everything, guys. So, yeah, make sure, like I said, make sure you have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.